A prize-giving ceremony was recently held for the winners of the first ever Proud of Taiwan and St. Lucia Lantern competition. A collaboration of the Taiwanese Embassy and the Cultural Development Foundation, the contest was organized in observance of Taiwan's National Day, October 10th. Out of 12 of the most accomplished lantern builders on island, Gilland Avril walked away with a $1,500 first place prize for his lantern piece entitled Proud of Where I Am From. It was the winning project of the 2020 Proud of Taiwan and St. Lucia Lantern Competition, the first of its kind coordinated by the Cultural Development Foundation on invitation by the Taiwanese Embassy to celebrate Taiwan's National Day. During the prize-giving ceremony, Executive Director of the Cultural Development Foundation, Ramona Henry Wynn, said the CDF targeted experienced lantern crafters for the competition in the interest of time. We quickly called our participants. Either they were, had, they were winners in previous years or they were facilitators at our training. Because of the, in the interest of time, we felt that, was, that would have been the best approach. So we called them in and... Uh, Everyone we called acceded to the request. They were excited about doing this competition. They did a level of research. They recognized the partnership that was so dear between the two countries, St. Lucia and Taiwan. And that was displayed in the lanterns that were prepared, as you can see, all around you. So to our artists, the CDFC, we are very proud of you. Bravo to you. Local observance of Taiwan's 104th National Day celebration was held at the Sandals Golf and Country Club on October 8th, where the lanterns submitted were displayed for judging. I have to say I was deeply touched uh, by all the creative and spectacular lanterns uh, when the moment the lights were switched off uh, at our National Day celebration reception. And uh, today, although this is the third time I see all the lanterns, it's still breathtaking. And art is something that has the uh, much power to connect people. And the proud of Taiwan and St. Lucia Lantern competition really show the beauty, the vitality, and the diversity of our two countries, and especially the strong ties between our two people. Minister with Responsibility for Culture, Senator Fortuna Bell Rose, commended the CDF for pulling off the inaugural event that displayed the strong ties that the two nations share. Last year we sent a delegation to Taiwan and uh, when we send people off our island, it's for them to go, learn, grow and come back and make a contribution. And what we see here is a clear manifestation of that. Last year we sent a team out headed by, of course, the chair of CDF, um, who is back here today celebrating the occasion, you know, um, with, with the um, Taiwanese ambassador um, through this lantern competition. This is what we want. And we do thank the chair of CDF and the team at CDF for the work that you did to realize this simple project that made a statement in terms of how we value our relationship and, of course, how we see the importance of the arts, you know, within our society. Winning the second place $1,000 prize in the 2020 Proud of Taiwan and St. Lucia Lantern Competition is Perry Marshall for his piece entitled Our Gift to Taiwan. And the third place $700 prize went to Kirk Peter for his piece Thank You Taiwan, which also won a $500 People's Choice Prize for Most Innovative Lantern.